So we have this ball right here, and right now this is solid, completely solid. It's like this rubber ball. It's heavy, it's solid, it would take a lot of resin and be rather expensive and heavy to print. So if I go through and I apply a hollowing to it, it is now hollowed, but if we run a suction cup detector, it's just a big, it's like a, a like this, where it's full of air, uh, it would be a big suction cup, it's hollow, but you couldn't print this, nothing can get in or out. This would be very bad. So what we need to do, of course, is remove that suction cup. So if I come over here and I put a hole in it and I run another suction cup detector, you'll see there's no longer any suction cups. However, this hole for the size of this is really small. It's kind of like this, where I have a little tiny hole and the air can't really get in and out really fast. In fact, it takes a really long time. If I were printing this, it would still be a suction cup. What we need is a hole big enough for something to happen really quick like that. So for that, we need to make sure we come over here and really make this hole a lot bigger. Now, not only did we get rid of the suction cup, but it's big enough that resin and air can flow through it. 